Starting off our top news article for today, the University of Michigan is offering the general public a free two-week online course on the UAP UFO topic. The class has the following attached to it. The subject matter is science, language is taught in English, the duration is two weeks, the status is still available, UM credit eligibility is no at this time. In the class, you'll discover how the UFO discussion relates to science and society. With a firm understanding of the history of UFOs, you'll start to explore the positions of UFOs within a larger conversation of science and culture. Learning from the experts at the University of Michigan and beyond, you'll hear from top researchers and scholars in the field to develop your knowledge of the study of UFOs. This course is designed for anyone interested in learning more about UFOs. You don't need any prior knowledge or experience. This teach out will be available until March 7th, 2022. Going to the eastern side of the world for the next story, Egypt archaeologists unearthed stunning ancient time capsules with 8,000 notes from the past. This is from www.express.co.uk. The discovery was made in an ancient Egypt town near the modern city of Soheg, Egypt. Experts uncovered thousands of astraka, which are inscribed pieces of pottery. They were used as notepads thousands of euros for ancient Egypt's detroit, private letters, and even laundry lists. But Egypt isn't the only place with something hidden underneath the earth. From www.13.org, colossal explosions shake a remote corner of Siberia tundra, leaving behind massive craters. Also in Alaska, a huge lake erupts with bubbles of inflammable gas. Scientists are discovering that these mystifying phenomena add up to a ticking time bomb. As long frozen permafrost melts and releases vast amounts of methane, a potent greenhouse gas. Methane is a compound with a chemical formula of CH4, one compound of one carbon atom bond with four hydrogen atoms. And lastly, we go back nearly 100 years for this next story by Proxidil Adventure. In December of 1900, three lighthouse keepers disappear without a trace while on duty on the Flan Isle. The table was set for food that was abandoned, the clock had been stopped, iron rails within the lighthouse were bent and twisted, and a one-ton boulder had been moved. They never have been found. Abby Normals, end of transmission.